You see the baby deer back there? The dumb screen is causing a problem. There's mama deer. Mama deer and the baby should follow shortly. I see the baby through the bushes. There we go. Baby's running away. Apologize for the terrible quality. Looks like a 1993 with the screen here. But the screen keeps the bugs outside when the window's open. Let's see if Cinnabon's here. I don't think he is yet, but we'll find out. There's our sweetie. Hey, buddy. Where you been? <laughs> oh, you full of furs. No. We'll have to debur you. <laughs> I know. We have to debur the little baby. How you doing? Oh, you have. Oh, boy. Hundreds. Uh, we'll have to help him. Just bring your food in, buddy. You have so many birds, my goodness. There we go. Oh, God. Lots of birds on Cinnabon. Eli's, oh my goodness, I just feel like a minefield on his back. Oh, this will take forever. I'm going to go ahead and uh, deburr him off screen. <laughs> yeah, otherwise it'll be a very boring video. Hey buddy, we got we got most of the birds off you, didn't we? Yeah, we got a majority. He helped a little bit. So we were taking a break from that. He has probably oh 85-90% reduction in birds, would you say? Hmm? Yeah. We're making progress, aren't we? We had a bunch of them. You must have been rolling around in the birds out there, huh? Yeah. Well, as I promised last night, you know, last night, or yesterday, rather, September 1st, every year, is Ginger Cat Appreciation Day, which we celebrated and took a quick video. Thank you to those who mentioned that on Instagrams. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very nice of them. Why don't we start the day off with some cat treats, buddy? Huh? Are you down for some cat treats? Aren't we having ample portion now? Mm -hmm. Yes, we do. We have plenty of cat treats for Cinnabon. Look how happy he is. Ready? Ready? Oh, yummy. We have three left. I thought I got more. Oh, whatever. No, it's not like you don't get enough of this. <laughs> oh, good boy. Another one? Another one? Oh. Today is also a very special day. Today, high five. Today, this channel has reached over 30,000 subscribers, so thank you all very much. That happened a lot quicker than I thought it was going to. It just seems like yesterday it was 25,000. Isn't that cool, buddy? Isn't that cool? Oh, what you got in your mouth? There's another bird. You pulled, you pulled one? Ew. Ew, why'd you eat that? Instead of on celebrating by eating, ew, got it. Don't want you eating that, buddy. So thank you all so much for watching these videos. We really appreciate it. If only Cinnabon knew, if I could express to him and Cat that how many people are interested in his life on our journey together, that would be pretty cool, wouldn't it? So it's very exciting. 30,000 people. So this video is going to be, going to be me telling you 30,000 reasons why I love Cinnabon. Just kidding. That, can you imagine how long that would take? I don't even know if I could live through that. That would be... I'd have to have frequent breaks and take days, wouldn't it? Not that I couldn't think of 30,000 reasons that I and others would love cinema. But thank you all so much for subscribing. What a good kitty cat you are. What a nice kitty. Oh, you know what else we need for you? In celebration of your 30,000 fans, why don't I give you some wet cat food, huh? Wet cat food? You want some wet cat food? Come on, let's go get some. Oh, I have just the thing. <gasps> Ooh, chicken recipe. Do you like chicken? Hmm? Let's find out if he does, okay? Ooh, look how fast we opened it. Ready? <gasps> You're getting spoiled today, aren't you, buddy? Mm-hmm. Well, you deserve it. Ooh. Okay. Yum, 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 yum. Let's watch him eat for a while. How cool is that? Just easy. That'd be kind of weird. Do you like that, buddy? Is that your favorite? Hmm? Isn't he just a spoiled little kitty? Yes, he is. Today's great because it's... Oh, we're gonna inspect the package? <laughs> Today is the 2nd of September. It's Labor Day, so happy Labor Day. I might post this on the 3rd, 
I probably will, probably will. So I apologize if some of the references don't make sense. But you know, that's how it is, right? That's how it is. Some of you have commented, some of the videos I record aren't posted until the week after. And I realize that causes some confusion because they're not chronological. I apologize for that, but it is difficult to... I mean, sometimes we'll, we'll just record for a while and then something funny will happen then I'll make a video on it or, you know, whatever. And I don't always do it in chronological order. Uh, some of you have requested me doing only a couple videos a week and making them all chronological. And honestly, while some of you would prefer that, I think most of you would like frequent, the frequent videos that we do at least one, one a day, typically sometimes two a day. Like on the weekend, I try to do more because I have a lot more time outside of work. So... Um, I try to come up with good compromises, and I think right now is at a decent uh, pace with the, with the videos. Every once in a while, I try to do an old school style, where it's just a single cut. And those are fun, too. Just quick, fun videos of cinema I'm playing. You know, at least 10 minutes of fun. I think my mom mentioned that. Somebody mentioned they wanted a three-hour video to help them go to bed, and I don't know if I could do that. That'd be a long, long video. But uh, I think there's a way you can loop a video that doesn't drive you insane, but... It's kind of interesting. What a good kitty you are, aren't you? Mm-hmm. So thank you again for joining us today. We are chilling on the kitty couch. Or we are, were. It looks like he wants to bail. You gonna take off somewhere, buddy? Okay. Oh, I think he wants more food. Or does he? Yep, we'll have to take a commercial break. Cinnamon wanted outside, so there he be. He seems to like it when it's really nice out, and it is pretty nice out today. Isn't it, little buddy? Are you enjoying yourself out here? It's very sunny. Cutie. What a nice kitty you are. Nice little kitty cat. So if you want to, go ahead and ask questions in your comment section, please. I'll do another Q&A video. I'm probably going to divide the video into three or four sections because last time it was about an hour long and that was a bit much for one video, so I'll break it up probably every day. Once the videos are ready, I'll drop them every day, you know, maybe in the morning, along with our regularly scheduled programming. <laughs> so yeah, feel free to ask away. I'll try to answer most of them, you know, the ones that are appropriate, of course, but you all do a good job of keeping it clean for all the kids out there. Isn't that right, buddy? Hmm? Isn't that right? So feel free to ask away. I look forward to seeing your questions, and I'll probably let it go maybe three, four, five days, and then I'll address them. But I'll leave ample time to kind of get the questions in. It's a nice day today. It's a perfect day to spend a day with the kitty cat. Do you want to go back inside, buddy? You're happy out here. Hmm? I'm going to run inside. You can join me if you so desire. I guess I'm joining him. <laughs> Thank you for joining us outside as well. <laughs> I wanted to share with you some cool books my brother gave me yesterday. Check these out. We have Dracula. I don't know if you can see that. Dracula Stoker. This is the first edition. Not the first print, but the first edition. It came out the year, or perhaps it's not the first, it's the year the book actually came out, which is pretty cool. I'll find the year. 1897, so this thing is over 120 years old. How cool is that? Random House, they've done Star Wars books too. How cool is this? Seems to be in very good condition. I don't think it was read much. This 
It's just something about, you know, going through a book that's that old 1800s. Pretty cool. I also like the, just the kind of ornate look and everything. Here's the uh, name. Ernest. That sounds like a name from the 1800s. Dracula the Vampire. I like how they gave it their own uh, title to the book. The next one is also cool. I'm sure I had a cover before. Baffling Detective Stories by Masters of Mystery. This one by Black. Baffling Detective. This is actually looks like a good book to read. Baffling Detective Stories, Masters of Mystery. 1928, so well, 90-some years old. Pretty cool. Well, this book also doesn't look like it's uh, been gone through that much. So I have a kind of a neat vintage library. You've seen it before. And this is totally random for this uh, video, but we're about randomness, aren't we, buddy? You want to go to the library with us? Hmm? Let's check the library out. Do, 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 do. Want to come with? Okay. Welcome to the library. We have to find places for these books. So, my favorite book. Campfire Chats of the Civil War from 1889, I believe. I'm going to put the Dracula book right next to it because that's my next favorite book now. Hey, thanks for joining us, buddy. Wow, looks like you've reached critical mass. Yes, you did. You enjoying yourself at the library, buddy? Hmm? I'm going to go ahead and uh, find new homes for these books. Here's another book from 1928. Hey, buddy, look, it's Birds and Beasts of the Romans. Okay, he's definitely not interested in this book. That's okay, though. I know how, what it feels like to not be interested in the book. But this one has a lion on it. One to your great, 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 great granddaddies, possibly. We'll put it back on the shelf. I don't think he wants to have any part of this. Some fun books. Not in any particular order. Yeah, it's just kind of fun. I need to read a lot more. If I do get back into it, I'll for sure start with these bad boys. Wanna come downstairs, buddy? Wanna come downstairs with me? Hmm? Oh, there we go. What a good kitty cat. He's like, this spot's cleared out now. I did a little bit of cleaning. Yep, that's your cat carrier. Well, thanks again. Thank you all for watching. And I appreciate you helping reach this milestone. 30,000 subscribers, pretty exciting. I wish I could express that to my little Cinnabon, as I mentioned before, but hey, for now, just words will do, and I bet he subconsciously knows. So thank you all. I look forward to, you know, reading the comments and seeing all the cool questions coming in. Haha, <laughs> he's getting on top of that. That's funny. Yeah, you want to jump in the freezer too? Just kidding. That wouldn't be very nice. But anyway, I'll address those questions in future videos. Probably do four parts, three or four parts, because the Q&A videos go pretty long, but they're always fun. So thank you all again, and I hope you have a terrific week. Bye-bye.